So the digital core, uh, particularly in the SAP terms, because this has been a big part of their shift in the marketplace, is the, the ERPs of old were such that you, you didn't really have a digital core, you just had everything. You had all of it that sat into one environment, and as long as it, it interacted well in that environment, it was extremely powerful, extremely integrated. And where SAP and now others in the market are starting to evolve is to say, we just need a very powerful central digital core and allow flexibility and innovation to happen on the edges. For me, the real, the real definition of the digital core is differentiation. It allows companies to truly take what is core to the business, maintain the power of it, but build their innovation and build their differentiation on the edges where it used to be very challenging to do that in some of the legacy environments. The abilities for companies to scale in the data and analytics world really comes from, at its core, the, the ability to become data driven. And when I say that, you have to have a level of trust that even if an output initially may be wrong or inaccurate, that you can quickly evolve those outputs to come to a trustworthy output. And, and it's challenging for companies under traditional development approaches because they're not used to an agile methodology and agile understanding of, hey, I may get this wrong, but the quicker I get it wrong, the faster I get it right many times. And that becomes a scale issue because you end up trying to do so much with one asset or one output versus being able to do many of those for many lines of business, many customers, whatever the audience may be that are consuming it. And it, and it challenges them and, and makes it an inability to scale.